back to another video. It's Lydia. Thanks for tuning in. And if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. I would love you if you do. And hit that bell button too to be a part of the notification crew and notification squad. Y'all know the drill. Let me know you're here and I'll show you some love in the comments down below. But for today's video, um, before we jump right in, I wanted to let you guys know that the giveaway winner from my declutter video has been selected and I have their information in my description box. Um, please don't be discouraged if you didn't win. I will be surely doing more giveaways in the future. So please don't hate me and just know that I will definitely be having more giveaways. But for today's video, I'm going to be doing another retrying video. So the last time I did this retrying type of video, I did it with the Kinky Curly Curling Custard. And essentially the reason why I did that video is because a lot of you guys wanted to see um, what my thoughts were on that product and kind of see me do a review. But I had already tried out that product and it had been a while since I tried it out. So I kind of wanted to retry it to see what my thoughts are on it. And I'm going to be doing the same thing with the main choice Crystal Orchid Biotin Infused Styling Gel. Now from what I remember, this was um, this is a really, really good gel. Um, however, whenever I would use it for my wash and goes, I would only use this gel alone. And I noticed especially in the summertime and even in the wintertime, it would make my hair feel like kind of dry. Um, it would make my hair feel super, super crunchy. So this time when I'm trying it out, um, I'm definitely going to be pairing it with a leave-in. Now the leave-in that I'm going to be going in with is the Almond Marshmallow Hydration Serum. This video isn't sponsored at all by any of these brands. It's just I bought all of these products myself and I already did like a little pre-test in terms of mixing them together in my hands um, and they seem to, you know, mix pretty well together. So I'm going to be pairing these two products together and we're just going to see if this product will work better in my hair now that I'm using a leave-in or if it will still be drying or whatever. So let me just go ahead, section off my hair and we'll jump right in. So I went ahead and sectioned off my hair real quick, but I figured I'd read the little description slash claims on the gel for those of you guys who may have not used this gel and kind of want to know what it's all about. It says, finally a gel that specializes in keeping your hair healthy while delivering an amazing hold at the same time. It's loaded with essential vitamins and nutritive ingredients. Um, a crystal orchid is sure to aid in your healthy hair growth regimen. So yeah, basically it's just a gel that gives you amazing hold. Um, and I'll tell you this, it gives a lot of hold on the scale of hold this is definitely on the stronger side it's definitely not medium I think it can maybe be medium if you don't go in with a lot but it's still definitely on the stronger side of um, holds when it comes to gels and it says that it's gentle enough for daily use it promotes growth and retention it defines curls and smooths edges men's detectable damage moisturizes hair and it tames frizz I don't know how much it moisturizes your hair but we'll see um, and it says it helps to minimize damage and breakage but yeah overall that's kind of what we're working with with the gel now I'm just gonna go ahead open it up it smells so good like I said before now I'm just gonna go ahead as always what this section is just water in this little spray bottle and then I'm gonna go in with just some of the almond and marshmallow hydration serum by Eden Body Works y'all know I love this stuff and then we're gonna go in with some of the gel but just to show you guys real quick this is what the consistency is like it definitely has that like putty slime type of consistency um, when you kind of work with it but when you take a little dollop onto your hand it kind of just melts right in and then I'm just gonna smooth it and rake it over like this I'm not gonna go in with like a crazy amount just because I don't want to you know overdo it and be too heavy-handed with the product I think what I like so far is that and what I know about this gel that I did like is that it clumps my curls together really really nicely um, which is something that I look for in a gel whenever I put it in my hair is how well it clumps my curls together but this is what we're working with so far now let's just go ahead and do this section so I need you guys to let me know, have you used this gel before? What are your thoughts? What do you think? Um, do you think it's drying when you use it alone? Um, have you paired it with a leave-in? What kind of leave-in do you pair it with? Um, I'm really thinking that this combination will be pretty, pretty good. I'm praying that it'll be good. Um, you know, I've never combined these two products together, so this is kind of like a first time for me for sure. But I have, I have some hope, especially with the way that my curls are feeling when I'm just breaking my fingers through if you guys can see I don't know they're looking good so far so I'm happy but now that we have these two sections done and I'm just gonna go ahead and do the rest of my hair really quickly and I'll definitely check in with you guys if I notice anything weird or funky going on especially towards the front or like the crown of my hair and yeah so let's just go do the rest of my hair real quick Alrighty, so 
so we're all done I just sprayed my hair with a little bit of the flawless by Gabrielle Union shine spray to kind of just seal everything in um, and this is what we're working with I think right now my hair looks pretty promising um, you know it looks pretty defined I'm really curious to see how well it will look when it dries and how how good it will feel when it dries if it will feel super you know dry and ashy or if it will feel like moisturized and still defined but we'll see um, and now I'm just gonna wait for my hair to dry and I will check in with y'all later Okay y'all, so it is day two and this is what my curls are looking like. As of right now, I'm super happy with how they look um, and how my hair feels. There's like zero, when I say zero, there's like zero gel cast, um, which is pretty amazing because I know I mentioned earlier this gel is supposed to have like a super strong hold and trust me, whenever I used it in the past by itself, it would be just so like dry and my hair would be so crunchy and like super weighed down. I'll try to find a picture of when I used it like last year or so um, and my curls just felt like just super weighed down and like super stiff but now I feel like my curls definitely have some like fluff and body to it there's no gel cast but the one thing that I will probably note is that next time I might not pair it with the Eden Body Works leave-in as much as I love that hydration serum I think I might need to go in with something a little bit creamier because I know with my hair as I go on to like day two I mean day three or day four it's definitely gonna need a little bit more moisture or I'm definitely gonna have to go in hard with like a moisturizing refresher spray um, so I'll probably next Next time go in with like my Shea Moisture leave-in, the Low Proxy leave-in, or my Jane Carter Untangle Me leave-in, just because these are just like a little bit more creamy as opposed to the hydration serum. That one's a little bit more like liquidy and hydrating. If that kind of makes sense, I don't really know. But next time I'll just try pairing it with those ones just because I know my hair, if I go on to like day three or day four, it may start to frizz up a little bit just because it's starting to get dry, but We'll see. And yeah, those are all my thoughts on this gel. Let me know down below if you plan on trying this gel or if you've tried it out and what your thoughts are on it and what you guys think of my wash and go. Do you think it turned out well, good, bad, ugly, all of the above? Let me know down below. But if you made it all the way to the end of this video, comment the word crystal down below just because you know this is the crystal orchid gel um so yeah comment the word crystal with maybe like a crystal emoji or something like that and be sure to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe i will love you if you do i won't hate you if you don't but i would love you if you do and be sure to share this with a friend as well um but thanks again and i'll see y'all in the next one peace